uh, Andre for Downhill Music here in Sydney again. Uh, just looking at another really cool little pedal that we have. It's a uh, pedal by a um, Danish company called uh, Mad Professor. Uh, it's called a Little Green Wonder. Um, uh, there's no, no, no major wonder on what this is trying to sort of do. It's a little bit of a tube screamer type scenario. Uh, it's uh, Works a little bit different to a tube screamer. It's got a little bit of bottom end in it, uh, and uh, it also um, is is really very highly reactive to uh, the input sensitivity. So if you're picking the strings nice and light, the pedal stays reasonably clean, and then if you sort of bash them a little bit hard there, uh, you get the gain. The gain it, it really hits the gain structure inside. So it's a really very responsive little pedal. Basic layout. Um, nine volt DC uh, negative tip power that it takes um, uh, on off true bypass uh, volume tone and uh, uh, drive the tone the tone knob I don't know even if they call it tone do they no they call it body and it, and it does something a little bit different to my ears when I when I wound it around here it, it, it at that setting there it's it's quite bright then and there's sort of like four places on this knob that, that really have a bit of significance in difference. This one here, the top top is just rolled off a little bit, and there's a little bit of mid pushed into it. Here, there's a little bit of higher mid pushed into it, and back over here again, it uh, sort of has the the tops back in. So there's no doesn't work like a conventional uh, tone knob for my ears anyway. <clears throat> uh, the uh, drive works like standard drive type scenario. What we might do is um, just hit it on with the drive about halfway, and you can have a listen. <clears throat> Once again, this is just a mess of ramp. Gain right up. You can hear. You can hear here. I'm pick, picking, picking with the fingers lightly, and 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 it's clean, cleanish. If I clean it up just a little bit. Now that's not touching the pedal in any way. Going nothing more than. Picking with the fingers and then and then then digging in with a pick. So then you can this this now you're hearing the pedal on full gain, so that is um, uh, as much gain as it has. Uh, I'll just try a couple of little power chord around this body thing. You can hear. I said this like uh, as you can hear this body knob really for my ears has scoop. a scoop yeah yeah it's like four four different sort of things happening so that's the way they they have that they don't have a, a like a, a, a high pass filter or anything like that on, 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 on this pedal but uh, listen, uh, a great pedal. This this particular one here is a PCB board one. I just forgot to say that earlier on. There are there are hand wired one versions of these as well. 
that you can get that are a little more expensive. But um, uh, this is the PCB board one, and I've got uh, I've got the the red distortion hand wired one, and and to, to my ears, I really don't hear the difference between those to the hand wired one and the PCB board one. But um, uh, uh, the chassis is different, but um, they're still very very robust, true bypass and. I'm getting the wind up again, man. So <laughs> uh, that's it. Uh, green pedal, red light, right? South Sydney. Mm. Don't know if I like that, but uh, mm. I have to think about that one and get back to everybody. But um, uh, there you have it, Mad Professor. Little Green Wonder. 